draft epilogue for the second edition of Les Fleurs du Mal by Charles Baudelaire. Tranquil as a sage and gentle as one who's cursed. I said, I love you, oh my beauty, my charmer. Many a time, your debauches without thirst, your soulless loves, your longing for the infinite, which proclaims itself everywhere, even in evil. Your bombs, knives, victory marches, public feasts, your melancholy suburbs, your furnished rooms, your gardens full of sighs and intrigue, your churches vomiting, prayer is music, your childish despairs, Matt Hags's games, your discouragements. And your fireworks, eruptions of joy that make the dumb and gloomy sky smile. Your venerable vice dressed in silk and laughable virtue with sad gaze. Gentle delighting in the luxury it shows. Your safe principles and flouted laws. Your proud monuments on which miscatch. Your metal domes, the sun in flames. Your theatrical queens with seductive voices. Your toxins, cannon, deafening orchestra. Your magic cobbles heaped as barricades. Your pretty orators, swollen rhetoric. Preaching love while your sewers run with blood. Rushing towards hell like the Oronico's flood. Your angels, your fresh clowns and ancient rags. Angels dressed in gold, purple, and hyacinth. Oh, you bear witness that I discharged my task, like a perfect alchemist, like a sainted soul. From everything I've extracted the quintessence, you gave me your mud and I've turned it into gold.